Okay, Sylph Cavern. Um, so I actually, like, I was at a point in the game past Force of Temptation where I was like, okay, I don't really remember the dungeons too well past this point. So this is going to be a little weird because I'm not really sure what I'm expecting at this point. Because it's been a long time since I first played the game and it's just, it's just been a long time. So... But for some reason, as soon as Rash showed up and he talked about, or we all talked about the self cavern and like having him help us get through here, I instantly remembered the self cavern. Self cavern, uh, can be very annoying. It's it's not, it's not the force of temptation, but it does have some very annoying things about it. So, oh yeah, I'm on this now. Super lightning blade. That is so cool. And so we have this new, uh, this gas cloud thing. Uh, he's dead. So it doesn't matter. But he can be kind of troublesome because he, like, does these area of effect attacks. Anyway, back to Self Cavern. See, the thing about Self Cavern is, like, it's really weird. Hey, those are inferior guards. Let me speak to them. Wait here for a moment. I wonder if Raz can convince them to let us through. I don't know. Inferior guards are, can be as stubborn as mules. Sorry to keep you waiting. Let's enter, shall we? How did you man to, manage to reason with them? You're such a salesman. You must be a great talker. Is that supposed to be a compliment? You bet! Rass is really something. Let's go, Reed. Don't you find this strange? It shouldn't be this easy to enter land annexed by the king. It's his aura. The guards probably trust his aura. Aura? Come on, Reed. Hurry. First things first. Let's go find the Wind Kramel. Uh, okay. You don't have to push me. So, Raz somehow was able to get let us get through. So, that was good. Can we enter here? Nope. What about over here? Nope! So you're going to, just right there, you're, you're going to experience what this self cavern has to offer, which is gusts of wind, which won't allow you to progress in an area. So this is going to be becoming annoying. Super lightning blade! Oh, God. Um, I probably should have cut this fight out, but whatever. I'll be sure to cut more fights out soon. But for right now, we're okay. I'm just like, I'm trying to explain things. Anyway, let's head in. So yeah, a lot of this place is going to involve the wind and how it pushes you places and stuff. Which is uh, rather annoying sometimes. All right, I went ahead and cut that fight out, but I just want to show something. Um, Rass's skills. He has Neo Swarm, um, which is pretty much Swarm. He has Dragon Swarm, which, um, like, Dragon Swarm. Like, holy shit. You thought Yuri was the first one? No, Dragon Swarm. <laughs> Dragon Flash, and he has a lot of really good skills, as you can see. These skills are sacred skills, which are pretty much, um, um, it advance arts or arcane arts I'm sorry so yeah we need to wait for the wind oh what the fuck why can't I why is it not letting me <clears throat> there we go I guess my timing was really bad Okay, this is where the Star of the Wind stuff is going to get really annoying. So, okay. 
Alright, um, Rask got a level in that fight. We get a Storm Shield here. So... Let's check out what this is. Shield that protects against Wind Kramos, which is really good for this area, so we want to put that on. So yeah, uh, Wind. Not fun. That, that wasn't actually, like, one of the bad parts about it. But we'll see soon what I'm talking about. This is one of the areas where it's going to happen, I know it. And here we have a new enemy, the Bone Knights. It's uh, the Skeleton Knights, except bony. They're bony. They look a little different. They're a little darker. Super Lightning Blade! Um, so yeah, I'm using a lot of arts now, so I'm running out of TP very quickly. Which is kind of a problem, but whatever. So, as you can see just now... I got pushed out, and I'm back at the start. So you're probably wondering, what the fuck? <laughs> well, this is going to be a load of fun, because I actually kind of forgot where I'm, how I'm supposed to handle this. I remember being stuck here for a while, though. God, this is really annoying. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on! Damn it, you... Why? Why does it go away that fast? Thank you. Okay, we're gonna go through here again. Okay, let's think about this methodically, shall we? Um, if you want me to be completely honest... Oh, you can't cross here. The wind's too strong. So what are we supposed to do? Stand back. Oh, he makes a rope thing, doesn't he? I totally forgot about that. Oh, that's smart. Now, if we hold on to the rope as we cross, we'll be fine. Pretty handy item you've got there. If you don't talk of that, or talk of that, if you don't talk to this little rock here, you'll never figure that out. You'll keep getting blown back every single time, and that's annoying. On your first run through, because you don't realize it, right? So, like... I just, I remember getting stuck at this part, like, at the very beginning. I'm like, what am I doing wrong? Where am I supposed to go? Am I, is there some way I'm missing? And no, you just gotta talk to that rock. So, luckily, I talked to the rock. Okay, so we have a little wind blowing right here. So we want to go around the uh, tornado because, as you can see, you can see the wind and the wind blowing the grass at the um, at the bottom of the screen. So you want to be careful there because I believe if you get blown in by that, you'll end up falling into a hole that you don't want to. And we have a new enemy, Dire Wolf. So we're gonna be showing this off a little bit. And uh, I'm at TP already because because I use all my stuff and also Farah, so I need to give some orange shells to people. Did I get a level up? I wasn't paying attention. I think I just yeah I got a level up. Cool. Okay. Uh, orange shells. Just throw like three on him and three on her. Good, we're good. So yeah, here's the thing here. We could try, just to see what happens. Let's. You want to try it? Let's try it. Is that not how it works? Oh. What is this thing? Oh. Okay. I thought for sure that was like a, a way to get blown in. So I guess I'm wrong. Sorry. It's been a while. I like when you see that on the ground. You like immediately think like, oh. Oh. Excuse me? Oh, this way. I was like, which way am I going? So you immediately think like, oh, the wind's going to push me that way, so let's go around. But I guess not. Being exposed to wind for a long time can take a lot of out of you. What do you think? Maybe it's time to get some rest. 
Huh? I'm still feeling great. When you push too, or when you push too hard, you went you Ah god, I can't talk. You wind up having accidents. Let's get some rest. You bet. Reed, your swordplay is impressive. You have a unique style. Where did you learn it? Self-taught. I'm a hunter. Hey, hey! Ross, what are you wearing? It's pretty. Ah, this is a compass key. Compass key? Yes, a compass key. It's a key with mysterious power that leads you to the right path. Hey, I've heard about those. So that's what they look like. Ras, so where does your path lead you? Earning money, of course. After all, I'm a merchant. If I may ask, why do you all want to meet the Greater Cranals? Huh? Is that strange? To want to meet them? It doesn't seem to be mere curiosity. I feel that there's a... A sense of purpose. Tiu gai tiu su tiai gual ti. Ras knows much. With greater cranels, we will. Well, well, wait a minute, Meredy. Why not? Let me explain to Ras. I'm sure he will be able to help us. Right? You wish to form a pact with the greater cranels. To save the world from the Grand Fall? Please believe us. I know this goes against all reasoning, but... You seem joyful somehow. I may have been waiting for a day like this to come for a long time. It makes me happy to think that I just might save the lives of people around the world. And... Yes? It makes me feel at ease. Oh? Knowing that my efforts help to bring happiness to others makes me feel comfortable. I've always felt this way. I see. Those are deep wounds. What is it that has made you so downhearted? From what do you run? Run? Me? How rude! Nothing would make me run. Really? Well, dried up slug carcasses aren't exactly my favorite, but that's about it. <laughs> I understand. I will broach the subject no more. But it's the truth. I'm sorry, my dear. Thank you for the interesting chat. Let us sleep. We have an early morning. Yeah, good night. So kind of a strange spot to uh, to have a little rest in the middle of a dungeon. We're just resting in here. A little scary. I should actually probably save at this point. And like they're kind of building up a little relationship kind of thing for um, Farah and Ras, which is kind of interesting. I actually kind of like those two. Like being a thing. I think they're good friends. I don't know if I would want them together per se, but I don't know. I, I kind of like those two. I feel like they understand each other well. So we have two ways to go. Let's try the let's try on the right first. And we finished that up pretty quickly. So over here we have I believe the entrance to the entire area so we don't want to go too far because we'll get blown i think i think that's the entrance it might not be but whatever let's go the airway uh before we get going i'm just gonna throw out another holy bottle just in case just gonna wait this out can you give me a blow yeah all right, so let's be careful here. You never know when the wind's going to strike. Let's 
check this out. Get Melange Gel back here. That's pretty good. Okay, I think we're okay. Maybe I was overreacting about the win. Maybe... Oh, you know what it probably was? I'm just gonna leave this fight in. I'm just gonna leave it in. You know what this probably was? This probably was just like a... Uh, like... A scarring from not being able to figure out the first room of the dungeon and I'm like oh this dungeon isn't that bad <laughs> unless it gets worse soon this actually isn't that bad like it's actually pretty fine I just I remember that first room and being like horrified like being so mad at this dungeon oh my god it's so annoying Come on. Come on. Thank you. I wish they would just let you stand there. Like, why did they tell you that? Like, oh, you cannot ascend because the wind's not there. Well, thank you. I know. Oh, I used two by accident. God damn it. Well, thank you. I, I know I can't ascend. Oh, you asshole. Oh, thank you. Get a mental ring right here. Uh, is that any good? Restores TP by 1% of max. That could be good. Fuck it, give it to Farah. So we're kind of in a bind though, because we have to go all the way back? Oh, game, you, you did the bad thing, didn't you? Oh, you asshole. Why is it all coming back? Why is it all coming back? Why is it all coming back? Oh fuck, I gotta make it all the way back there. God fucking damn it. Oh, uh, should I just cut ahead? God damn it, that's so bad. Oh, that sucks. Like, oh fuck, ow. That really sucks. Like, I gotta make it all the way back there. Why would you not hang on to the rope when you're falling over? Like, if you're falling that way, just grab onto the rope. Oh, it the wind was... Oh. I'm sorry. I'm not I'm not actually mad. But the wind was... Oh, game. Game, that's not cool. Like, that's actually not cool. <sighs> Alright, we're back. Just, uh, just need to calm down a little bit. Um... So, I'm sorry I'm kind of walking back all the way. Eh, why not? Let's camp. But, like, I'd rather just... I mean, I could cut ahead, but, you know, doing that was actually useful. Like, we got the mental ring. And it's not a large walk back, so it's not a big deal. So, can't believe I used two holy bottles by accident, but oh well. But we need to use another one right here. Give me some wind. See, I think this is dumb. I think this is really stupid. Like, why would that happen? Why would you make it last, like, two se- or Not even two seconds. Like, one second, it's over. I think that's dumb. So, back over here. Back here, Krispy Kreme. Knock over that- Oh, God, really? Like, I- I really don't like that. Okay. So let's not fuck up this time and be greedy. This looks dangerous as well. I'm going the other side. Fuck that. Oh my god! We have new enemies and they're scary as fuck! That's a mad eel! Jesus Christ, these things are... Why are they in the wind dungeon? Why are a bunch of eels in the wind dungeon? It's terrifying. Whatever. <laughs> I don't know why I question it. This is really scary, though. Okay, up here we get a 1800 gold, which is really nice. We go down here, we get the Assault Dagger, which could be good. Let's check it out. Assault Dagger! Yes, right here you get a lot more... Oh, this is actually really good. You get a lot more accuracy, like... Yeah, even though the sword I have on is really cool. Like, lose 10, gain like 
40 or whatever and get more accuracy? Like, fuck yeah. I think we're done here. Okay, I want to be careful. I don't want to fuck up. So, what's in here again? Orange gel? That's pretty good. I need some of those. Over here. Yeah, lemon, lemon gel. That's always good. Anything back here? Nope. Okay. Just waiting. Just waiting. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry, I know. Ah, oh, you butt! You butt! What do we got? Oh, we got we got blood biters and hornets. We got a bunch of new enemies. I was about to say like, there's not a lot of new enemies in this dungeon. It's a bunch of like new like old guys. But now we're getting a few more new ones. There we go. Got a level up for Merity. Good job, girl. But yeah, besides the whole wind gimmick, there isn't a lot to this dungeon. So, we're just going to be traversing this place a little bit. I'm a little scared. I don't want to get blown off or anything. So I'm a little scared. Okay, we're good. Sylph's dungeon, is, as you can see, is a lot longer than... Um... <clears throat> get a needle glove there. Could have saved money for Farah, but oh well. Sylph's dungeon is a lot longer than Undini's dungeon, so... You want to be careful here. Um... So we could go down there, but there's also that right there. Alright, we took care of them. So, I guess we'll check out what's up here first. Okay, we got a chest. Get an arc wind? What is that? A spear of wind. One swing of the spear causes a gust of wind. That's pretty radical. If I do say so myself. Um, did I pass it? Yes, I did. That is a lot of thrust. I'm working on... Um, Slash right now, so I don't really need it, but... Am I working on Slash? I am, don't, aren't I? Yes, I'm working on Slash. So I don't need it right now. Oh, I didn't know that was there. But, it's something to have. 